In this video, we are going to learn how to find the common multiples of two numbers or three numbers or four numbers, any, any number of numbers are there. We don't care. Just we will try to find out the common multiples of those numbers. Right? So first we should know multiples. We have already learned in the previous videos what is multiples. One more time I'm telling what is what is multiple means. Uh, like here I do have number 3. So if I'm saying multiples of 3, then I mean that those numbers to which 3 can divide those numbers to which this this 3 will divide without any remainder so 3 can divide this 3 without any remainder in one time similarly 6 6 can be divided by 3 without any remainder similarly 9 can be divided by the 3 without any remainder similarly 12 15 18 and so on so there are unlimited multiples of the 3 so those numbers, those huge number of list, you know, the, the, those those huge list, huge number of list, those numbers to which this three can divide without any remainder, or you can simply understand in the way like uh, you had learned the table of three, something like three times one, three, three times two, uh, six, three times three, nine, three times four, twelve, like that you had learned. So all the numbers of the three tables, all right, like three. 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, like this, you know, you just go. Those all numbers means the multiples of 3. So here, now we are going to find out the common multiples. Okay. Suppose we need to find out now the common multiples of, uh, uh, say, uh, 3 and 4. Okay. So multiples of 4. First, I am going to write here all the multiples of, uh, um, all the multiples of uh, 3. So multiples of 3 are 3, and then 6 and then 9 and then 12 and then 15 and then uh, 18 and then 20 it's not looking like 18 and then 20 uh, 3 6 9, 12, and then 15, and then 18, and then 21, and then 24, and then 27, and so on. Right? Similarly, now here I'm going to write all the fa uh, all the multiples of 4. So the multiples of 4 here are 4, and then 2, uh, and then 8. Right? the tables of 4 actually and those numbers to which 4 can divide easily without any remainder 4 8 and then 12 12 can be divided by 4 you know and similarly 16 similarly 20 24 right 28 and so on so now i need to find out the common multiples common means mutual you know in 3 also and in 4 also so just check out those numbers which are in 3 also and which are in 4 also Right, so see here in the list of the 3 and 4, what is going to match? Yes, I got the first number 12. 12 is going to match in the uh, multiples of 3 also and in the multiples of 4 also. Next one, let's find out. Let's find out. Let's find out. Yes, 12 and then 24. All right, and the next one, if you'll see here, you'll get 36, and here also you'll get 36. In the table of 4, 36 comes on. Yes, 9 times 4 into 9, or you can say 4 times uh, 9 equals to 36, and here 3 times 12 equals to 36. So 36 is another next one. And after that, you will get here 48, you know, because 3 times 16 equals to 48, and uh, 4 times 12 equals to 48, you will get here. So these are the numbers which are common in 3 also and in 4 also. But you might be asking, how do I know this 36 and 48? So I am giving you a trick. See, first you find out the, what is the what is the first common multiple between any two numbers. Like here in three and four, what is the first common multiple? That is twelve, right? Then, then it's a very happy news for you. Just you should know the table of twelve. That is the first common multiple between three and four is twelve. The next will be twenty-four, and the next will be thirty-six, and the next will be forty-eight. Next will be sixty. Next will be seventy-two. Like this, right? Very easy. So. 
just the problem is to find out the first common one what is the first one what is the first common multiple between the, these two numbers once you get then you just you just think that all the multiples of the 12 will be the common multiples of 3 and 4 see the f the, the all the multiples of the first common multiple between the 3 and 4 will be the common multiples of the 3 and 4 right so the first common multiple between 3 and 4 was 12 so all the multiples of the 12 will be the common multiples between the 3 and 4 i hope you understand this i'm i'm, I'm taking one more example here very simple so that you can easily uh, you can you can understand i'm taking 2 and the 3 so what what is the common multiple between 2 and 3 we need to find out so before uh, that i need to find out all the multiples of 2 and we know that the multiples of the 2 are those numbers which 2 can divide so 2 can divide this 2 it can divide 4 it can divide 6 it can divide 8 and then 10 and then 12 and then and then and then uh 14 and then 16 and so on so there are there are you know actually lot of multiples huge number of multiples we have unlimited multiples so we don't have to write all and in question also if they are asking in, in the question uh, they will specify you just need five first multiples or uh, three first multiples something like that the question will come and the next one is the multiples of the three that is like three and then six and then uh, nine and then twelve and then uh, fifteen you know and then uh, eighteen and then so on here is also another next one is 18 okay so what I told you we have to just find out the first common multiple so what is the first common multiple yes 6 is common in both in 2 also and 3 also so here common multiple here common multiple is common multiple is first you write 6 and without any more thinking you just write the table of 6 now 6 and then 12 and then 18 and then 20, uh, 24 and so on and you check it up if you don't believe now check it up see here 12 is common here also and uh, next one will be 18 see 18 right and the next common will be here also 24 and here also 24 if you, if you elongate it if you write till there right and as here common multiple was I forget to write here the common multiple by the way common multiples here are 12 and then 24 and then 36 that I have written already here alright so this is the way how to find the common multiples I hope you understand this and I'll take some more problem uh, taking three or four digits in the next video and that will give you more concept I hope you understand goodbye catch you in the next video